Thanks, Will. They're the biggest boy band in Britain, but which member of JLF is actually the best? Here on Suck My Pop, we set out to find out the answer by putting the lads through various scientific tests. So far, we've tested them on strength and height, but how will they compare when it comes to looks? And which one will emerge as the overall winner? Here are the results. Previously on Who is the Best One in JLS? Science has the answer. Marvin wins the strength test. Marvin proves to be tallest. And Aston loses his rag. Come back here, little man. Now it's time for the final tests as we find out who is best in JLS. Science has the answer. Test three, best looking. The laws of science state that the more symmetrical your face is, the better looking you are. So we've put each of your faces into our special data processor. Wow. And I can tell you now that all of your looks are way above the national oh, average. Wow, oh, well done, Jonathan. Above one. average, us. Oh, that's nice mm -hmm. to know. Arishi, according to science, you have excellent general facial symmetry. But your eyes are apparently a bit too close together. Oh. Oh, wait for yours. <laughs> Don't be laughing until you've had yours. JB, your eyes are located in the perfect place. But according to science, your nose is a bit too small for your ears. Wow. Aston? No. Your nose is near perfect. But scientifically speaking, your eyes are a little bit too wide apart. So I can see it. <laughs> <laughs> I can see you coming. <laughs> Marvin? Yeah? The computer says your eyes are perfectly shaped, but your ears are a bit too long for your nose. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a long ears. <laughs> In conclusion, science states that you are all ridiculously good looking. Oh, wow. Congratulations, Rich. Jonathan, well Jonathan. Well done, well thank you, Jonathan. Well but the best looking member with a scientific face score of 8.2 wow. is. I hope that's out of 10. <laughs> JB. Oh, I told you to do that. You didn't really. Jonathan, well done. No, 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 no. Jonathan, my congratulations on Jonathan. Jay, well, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, it's time for our final and arguably most important scientific test. Absolute fitness. Test four, abs, absolute fitness. Second only to diamonds, your abs have been scientifically proven to be the hardest material in the known world. <laughs> wow. What scientist <laughs> is this? Are you sure? Using our optometer, also known as the finger of influence, we shall now test who has the hardest abs. JLS? Yes, Kimberly! Lift. Flex. Interesting. It is interesting, Kimberly. But which of the boys has the hardest abs according to science? Okay, the results are in, and I can tell you, according to science, you all have the full 10 out of 10 abs rating. It's a full way So the crucial absolute fitness test ends in a four way tie. As far as science is concerned, all the boys have bloody lovely abs. Final results Orishe performed well in the height test, JB proved to be best looking. Aston, well, the less said about Aston, the better. Marvin Sean in the strength test. But just who will come out on top now the final results are in? Over to you, Kimberly. Science. In fourth place, <laughs> it's Aston. <laughs> <laughs> Terrible news for the little man, and he doesn't seem to have taken it well. Fix. <laughs> in third place, it's JB. Oh, I knew he was going to say something. <laughs> this is a face. Oh. Do you know what I mean? In second place, it's a reshape. Sounds like oh. rubbish, man. Oh. What is this? I'm a I'm a I'm a to red trainers. This is a big face. I'm leaving this place. Man. So, the best one in JLS, according to science, is Marvin. Oh, thank you. Thanks, dude. Thank you very much. Thank you. Wow. Come away, man. Come away. Come Don't be haters. These are haters, see? No. Not no hater, man. Look, he's still. Why'd you always win?
Marvin champion fact. He is, but I have to say they were all amazing on the day and very, very competitive. But they're nice lads. Yeah, and Aston, remember, you may have come forth on the day, but you'll always be number one in my heart, big guy, right here, okay? Let's talk rumours.